So the way the system works starts right here. There's a vinyl string, a very strong string, that's tied to the weir of the sliding door. And that string runs all the way into the van. And there's effectively cables that runs to a motor. The motor is right there. The motor then runs to a rate meter. The rate meter helps determine how fast this cable is moving. And then the cable goes all the way here, out through the side. Out through here. And you can see the other end of the string is connected right there. So it's tied effectively to the rear of the door on the back. So effectively it can pull in either direction. And that's how it opens and closes. The actuator that unlocks the latch is inside the door and it gets power from these two terminals. Those two terminals are connected there and that's how it knows when the door is open or closed. And that then is fed by a cable that goes all the way to up here all the way back to the controller, which is right there. There's another cable that goes from the controller all the way down to the battery. I've connected to the uh, CCP point, as well as to the main switch, which I've yet to mount. And then it comes with a remote control, which communicates with the controller. Note that if the door is locked, this does not unlock it automatically. So you must make sure that the door is unlocked before you try to open it. 